Hello, now we need to uh, take the next, uh, another lecture of how to find the uh, state space representation of differential equation which has a, a derivative of its input function. The forcing input has its derivative. For example, if we have this uh, differential equation, y plus uh, 648y okay if we have this uh, differential equation I need to put in uh, at, uh, state space form okay if uh, I need to uh, find the, uh, the transfer function for this how to find it using Laplace transform using Laplace transform so we take the plus x cube y s plus 18 s square y s plus 198 s y s plus 640 y s will equal to 160 s u s plus 640 u s okay so we take from here y s common part we get s cube plus 18 s square plus 192s plus 640 all times y f s and we take from here the y us as a common part so s plus 640 okay time all this times u f s we got y f s over u f s will equal to 160s plus 640 over s, s cube plus 18s square plus 192s plus 640 okay this is the transfer function and this is the characteristic equation characteristic equation okay so now I need to focus on um, this which is very important this equation okay or this equation this one the original one okay so I'll take the first one this one okay let me write it here again which is y triple dot plus 18 y dot plus 192 y dot plus 640 y equal to 160 u dot plus 640 u okay uh, the general form for this will be triple dot plus u begin like now okay a1 y double dot and you go a2 y dot plus a3 y and to reach y okay this now if you have here third derivative of y you go the same way u triple derivative and we have here some constant b0 plus b1 u double dot plus b2 u dot plus b3 u okay so you compare all these coefficients with your example here okay so we have a1 this one because this is multiplied by y double dot and this multiplied by y double dot and a2 will, co will be uh, corresponding to this and a3 corresponding to this so a0 it's not compared it's compared to zero here there's no part uh, there's no u triple dot there's no uh, by the way this is uh, d cube u by d t cube it's a third derivative of uh, the forcing function with respect to time okay 
so and now b1 there is no uh, corresponding part so it's equal to zero and you have b2 here will, will correspond to this because both multiplied by u dot and this will be compared to this okay so let me write it h1 a1 will equal to 18 a2 will equal to 192 a3 equal to 640 and we have b0 will be equal to 0 b1 equal to 0 b2 equal to 160 and b3 equal to equal to 640 okay now we're almost there so now let me define something now b0 equal b0 and beta 1 equal to b1 minus a1 beta 0 and beta 2 goes to b2 minus a1 beta 1 minus a2 beta 0 you can note how it, is, it will be go so you go until b beta 3 okay this is the rule b3 minus a1 beta 2 minus a2 beta 1 minus a3 beta 0 okay so we get this still we need something else which is x1 now x1 equal to y minus beta 0 u x2 will be equal to x1 dot minus beta 1 u and x3 will equal to x2 dot minus beta 2 times u okay x1 dot u take dot for this and x2 dot take dot for this one okay so let me write here we have this x1 dot will be dot for this y dot minus beta 0 u dot minus beta 1 u beta 1 u and this one x2 dot x2 dot for all this is x dot by the way this u dot okay so you take x2 dot which will be y double dot minus beta 0 u double dot minus beta 1 u dot minus don't forget this one minus beta 2 u okay we're almost there so the the state space form if you if you use this uh, this method will be x1 dot x2 dot x3 dot will equal to 0 1 0 0 0 1 minus a 3 minus a2 minus a1 multiplied by x1 x2 x3 plus beta1 beta2 beta3 times u okay a3 as we defined here it's 6 a3 will so uh, minus 6 will equal to 0 1 0 minus 6 4 0 so so let me write here if I have space if I oh, sorry I don't have space so let me 0 1 0 0 0 1 minus a3 which is minus 6 4 0 minus a2 will be minus 1 9 2 and minus a1 which minus 18 okay this multiplied by x1 x2 x3 plus beta 0 beta 1 sorry if you substitute this value so it's uh, beta 0 it will be 0 it will be 0 and beta 1 will be 1 which is 0 minus something times 0 will be 0 and uh, after you um, uh, substitute this value you'll find this one six zero and this uh, will be find uh, one two two four zero okay so you substitute it here 
in this beta or in beta 2, beta 3, and you'll find it 0, 1, 6, 0, and minus 2, 2, 4, 0. Okay, this multiplied by u. Okay, so this is your state equation. And now we need the output equation. The output equation will be 1, 0, 0. This form x1, x2, x3, plus beta 0 times u. And beta 0 from here uh, will equal to 0. So this equal to 0. All this goes to 0. So we're left with this. How we find this equation? You can go back here. And you find x1 dot, uh, if you substitute x1 dot um, for this um, uh, x1 dot here, it's just equal to x2. If you find, sorry, if you if you see here, it's just equal to x2 plus zero times u, which is this one. If you if you take this part, and you know beta one is equal to zero, so x1 dot just equal to x2. Okay. And x2 dot, if you uh, if you take this, if you just take this one, okay, x2 dot equal x3 plus beta 2 times u, so x3 like now plus this beta 2 times u. Okay, if you see, uh, you'll find that all these are correct. Thank you for watching. See you next time.